and the Finance Minister, Matthias Cormann, joined me earlier from Perth. Senator Cormann, thank you very much for coming in. Good to be back. As Finance Minister, you would be deep in the weeds uh, in preparing for Budget Day. It's a big undertaking. Would it be even be ready to go on May the 3rd if necessary? Uh, well, the budget is scheduled on the second Tuesday in May, the 10th of uh, May. That is the date that the Treasurer and I are working towards. That's the date that the Prime Minister is uh, working towards. That's the date that all of us uh, in government uh, are working towards. Let me ask you to respond to something the former Liberal Premier of Victoria, Jeff Cannett, had to say earlier today. This talk about an early election is an indication, sadly, that the government does not have a plan for the future of the country and they're trying to use this talk of a double dissolution, an early election, simply to cover up their own failings? Well, we're not talking about an early election. Uh, we are uh, expecting the election to take place in the ordinary course of events uh, in the latter part of uh, the year, uh, as the Prime Minister has indicated, in August, September, October. I mean, that's when the uh, three years are uh, up and that's uh, what we're working towards. Well, you say we're not talking about it. Where, where then do you think this speculation has come from? Well, I mean, I've, you know, for, for as long as I've been involved uh, in uh, public service uh, through the parliament, uh, every year as you get closer to the election, there's a lot of uh, speculation in the media, there's a lot of speculation from commentators. Uh, it was the same in 2013, it was the same in 2010, it was the same in 2007. Uh, it's the same this year. And uh, th that is not something that we control. All we control uh, is uh, the job that we're doing. We're focused on providing good government uh, for Australia and we're focused on making sure we're in the best possible position uh, to uh, win the next election in the second half of this year and, and to provide good government over the next term.